You're watching the book reviewer with Cindy Brady, where we make hardcovers soft. Hello, and welcome back to another episode of the book reviewer with your host Cindy. And I have another book review to share you guys. So I picked this one up from the library. Um, it is a new book. Um, and I looked at it, it has a copyright date of just last year, so it's a new one. Um, it's called Dear Amy, a novel by Helen Callahan. And it is a new book according to our library. It is a fiction book. So, um, this is what this book is about. Margot Lewis is a teacher at an exclusive high school in the English University town of Cambridge. In her spare time, she writes an advice column called Dear Amy for the local newspaper. When one of Margot's students, 15-year-old Katie, disappears, the schools in town fear the worst. And then Margot gets a, a Dear Abby letter, unlike any she's received before. It's a desperate plea for rescue from a girl who says she's being held captive and in terrible danger. A girl named Beth Ann Avery, who was abducted from the local area 20 years ago and never found. The letter matches a sample, sample of Beth Ann's handwriting that the police have kept on file since she vanished. And this shocking development in an infamous cold case catches the attention of criminologist Martin Foster, Forster, who has been trying to find Katie in the mysterious Beth Ann. Margot sets out, with Martin's help, to discover if the two cases are connected. But then Margot herself becomes the target. So, um, this is a psychological suspense story. Um, for those that have been around for a while, um, you know that I graduated from Southern New Hampshire University online um, with a minor or an associate in psychology. And for those that are new, um, that's the thing about me. I have a minor in psychology. Having that kind of background, this was an interesting book to read. Um, the ending was not what I expected at all. Um, I'm not going to spoil it for you guys. Um, it's just expect the unexpected. <laughs> So, um, this book does have a Kindle edition, you guys. So, it has 31 chapters and 343 pages. Um, that includes a couple pages that have the acknowledgments and people that um, Helen Callahan wanted to acknowledge for this book. So, um, the Kindle edition seems to be a little longer, about 10 pages longer. 10 pages longer, if I could say my words right. Um, I will put affiliate links in the description below. So in essence, it has been quite the experience reading this book. It kept me guessing till the end, that's for sure. Um, I would recommend this book to about anyone. Um, one word of caution though, um, for those that um, have been in abusive relationships before in um, has suffered any kind of abuse, I would say proceed with caution because there are some scenes in the book that might be triggering for some. So, um, that's about all that I, that I will say about that. Um, comment in the comments section below. Have you read this book? Did you like it? Did you hate it? Or does this review make you want to read this book now? Um, the book reviewer wants to know. Hashtag the book reviewer wants to know. Um, that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Keep reading. Don't stop believing. And we will see you again tomorrow for another book review. Bye guys.